Hello guys, welcome. In this tutorial, we are going to talk about what is a prompt and what is a prompt template. So let's first understand what is a prompt. A prompt is a specific instruction or input provided to an AI model to generate a desired output. It can be a text output, image or code, right? So let's say we go over to ChatGPT or Microsoft Bing Copilot and we say, hey, write me an email to send it to one of my customer to welcome him. So let's say that is the instruction that you have given. So that instruction is called as prompt. Essentially, it is a way to guide the AI in producing content that aligns with a particular goal or theme, right? So basically, you want an answer and in order to get that answer, you need to give some instructions to the AI model. And that instruction is called as a prompt. So for example, if we go over to ChatGPT and we say, write a short story about a journey through space, that is your prompt that you're giving to ChatGPT and ChatGPT is going to give you back a short story based on that prompt. Okay, so that is what a prompt is. Prompt is basically instruction that you give to AI model to generate a response. Now that response can be a text response, can be an image response, it could be a code, etc. So that is what is called as a prompt. Now, what is a prompt template? Prompt template in Salesforce is a reusable prompt designed to interact with large language models to generate content. So prompt template is like any other template, like any other email template, right? So we create, when you're sending an email, there's a concept of creating email templates, right? So you write the generic email, you include some merge fields, and then what happens is during the runtime, those merge fields gets customized based on that record ID, right? So whichever it fetches the details from that record, which you have passed into that email template. Similarly, you have is called as a prompt template. A prompt template is a reusable prompt designed to interact with these large language models. These templates include placeholders for specific details about customers, products, and other relevant data which are filled in dynamically to create personalized prompts. So what happens is eventually, once it has fetched that information from the Salesforce data, that prompt template actually gets converted into a proper prompt, right? So from the prompt template, you create a prompt. What is a prompt template looks like? This is how a prompt template looks like. So you can see here, there are placeholders over here. I, this is a placeholder called customer name. So during runtime, it is going to fetch that information from your Salesforce data and it is going to replace it over here. Okay, so that is what happens behind the scene. So you have provided a prompt template. Now inside of the prompt template, you will have a bunch of placeholders. That placeholders will actually get replaced with CRM data. It will fetch the fields from CRM objects, replace it there. It can fetch related lists, etc. So that is what happens. And then that prompt template actually gets converted into a proper prompt. And that is the prompt that we send over to our AI model. So I hope this makes it clear between what is a prompt and what is a prompt template. Prompt template is more of a reusable template from which you create prompts. That is what the definition is. Okay. So I hope you guys are enjoying these tutorials. And uh, the reason I might sound a little repetitive is I want to make sure you are understanding the concepts very clearly and very thoroughly, right? We have, we are going to one chance and we have to pass the exam. So it's okay if I'm repeating the information, but as long as you're understanding it and you're, you are revising at the same time, you, we are good. Okay. So I'm going to see you in the next tutorial. Thank you very much.